Hey everybody, the Bond is back. Welcome to part 9 of Let's Play Mega Man Network Transmission. Alright, seeing as how we got yet another key, which is Link Code Z, we might be getting closer to the Zero account. And I could tell because, well, obviously Z starts... Well, Zero starts with Z. So that's gotta be it. Also, in between episodes, I finally got enough M cannons so that I carry the max. The bad news is it's only 10. Which makes sense because it does 120 damage. So, you know, pick your poison, I suppose. I'll just take my legs, I don't want to give a rat's ass. What I need to do is finally get things done with the Zero Virus. So I think we should be well armed and ready to go for what's coming our way. I don't believe there's only this much left in the game already. This is not a long game by any means. Obviously not compared to any Battle Network game, which of course is RPG. So of course you get several hours out of it. But at the same time, I thought this game would be a little bit bigger. Oh well, whatever the case, there's... At least there's three mystery datas you can just grab. Before you even go in here. So let's freaking go. Wow. This looks like something out of Mega Man X5. Oh. I see you're trying to get health back from that candle. Can't let you do that. Thank you for opening up and dying for me. To memory. And for spikes. Uh, might not use my double jump. And a power up! Okay, I think that's the second last power up in the whole game. There we go. Now we in business. Now we making things happen. Before I commit to a drop, let's see what's over here. I... oh. Drop nothing for me, huh? I guess I, I did take too long to destroy it. Hmm, okay. Mostly money. Ooh, a reg up, too! Ouch! Ooh, what you got? I don't think I've ever got a chip from this kind of virus. Three-way. <laughs> I finally got myself a three-way! That can be taken so many different ways. Extra code on two? I guess that's hint? That's the second one I picked up. Area with roll, repair on continuous spikes area. Okay. I don't even know if that's anything I can work with. Oh, another HP memory. That's cool, I guess. Alright, here's what I'm thinking. I'm better off just jacking out. Because <laughs> by the time I get back to the other side, where I'm supposed to go, I'm going to be taking more spike damage. So it's best to go in there with like a clean bill of health. And then we can probably skip a good part of this level. Since we don't need to go there again. I think that'll be better for us in the long run. Okay, you're not really gonna give me any cannons for this. Okay, that's probably the first time in a while that I dodged both dodge the attack on that jabroni pony. Or jabroni wolfie. Doesn't matter. I'm dead now. I'm dead, Jim. I'm sorry. I had to do it. Didn't have enough time to put him to the back of the barn before I put him down. 
I can call him Old Yeller because he is a yeller color. There you go. It fits. You know, i never seen the movie Old Yeller, but I think my sister did and she was, of course, sobbing. Because she does not handle, like, animals dying, which not many people do. So I can understand that. I guess we can safely go down. Well, subjectively safe. George Zenny's. Oh well, I guess I can always just bait it. There you go. I know there's a fire aura. Do I need to fight you? Like, if you're at just the right height, it'll just keep spamming that move over and over. And you don't have to worry about it. It'll just keep going over your head. Oh, shit. That was put in a bad spot. So I was taking every hit on the way. Is this worth going to? I guess we'll just have to say yes. Hammer? Is that the first time I got a hammer? It might have been the first time. And a mem up. Okay. That's cool, I guess. At least there's money over here as well. And go turn it down that sweet, sweet cash. Wait, gold is how much? I guess 70 70 now. 73 70. So gold zenny is worth 300. That's good to know. We can make a nice chunk of change doing that part. Well, I used up all my Recove 80s already. That's the highest recovery I got. Hmm. Do I recognize that color? I don't think that's water, is it? No. I don't think that is. Wait, boss time already? I mean, that's fine and dandy, but it looks like there's more over here. Maybe I should try jumping from an upper conveyor belt. Or, you know... No, 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 no. Maybe I was better off just using all my double jumps. It's not like I'm going to be using them much else. They're not good for bosses, so there you go. Huh. Another HP memory. It's a thought that counts, I guess. Damn. Ooh, there's a backup! Okay, that was a lucky find as well. I don't feel good facing the boss right now. So maybe I'm just better off taking the death and then trying again later. Oh, maybe Invis should be my default. There we go. I think I'm just gonna take the death. Actually, let's see how well we do. Maybe if I'm playing my cards right, I might actually beat zero on the first try. Assuming that's zero. Oh, that's definitely zero, all right. Zero. Be tall. So that's zero? But he looks just like... a Navi. He seems like just any other Navi, with the same heart and mind. Starman, is that you? Oh, it's you, Mega Man. You beat Starman, didn't you? Finally, to actually meet you. What? You know who I am? 
Oh yes, I know about you, Mega Man, and about your operator, Lan Hikari. Who the heck are you? My name is Zero, and I am a cursed virus. I've never heard of a talking virus before. All the Zero viruses spread throughout the cyber worlds are my eyes and ears, transmitting info. At first, all I did was spy and gather info. Somehow, I don't know exactly when, but I gained a soul. You evolved? A virus? A virus with a soul? You are warriors, fighting for peace in the cyber worlds. I, on the other hand, spread evil by simply existing. So you must be here to delete, that is, bust me, right? But I have no plans to dis disappear just yet. I'm ready to fight you. Wait! You're... We have no choice! Mega Man! Battle routine set! Execute! Alright, Zero, let's go. Oh, wow! It was going well at first until I slid into that attack. Okay, so at least I'll go into this fight with a full set of health. This will go a lot better now. Now I don't have to worry so much. Okay, so when I get too close, that'll happen. Sometimes if you hit him, he'll teleport. So use that chance to hit him again. Wow. So that AI can easily be exploited. Just keep beating a hit, get away, and you'll beat him with few hits. I didn't even have to use a chip. Your power is beyond specifications. So this is the force that beat the World 3. What is it? The power of friendship? Friendship. It's a feeling I've never experienced before. But I think I understand it. Well, you beat me. Go ahead, kill me. Zero, you... You know, I didn't ask to be born as a virus. But I want to know one thing. This world where I was born and its people. And you, the humans and navvies, you see me as evil incarnate, spreading poison. So there's nothing to be concerned about. It's just the way it is. Lan, I think I understand how Zero feels. Ah, Zero ain't all bad after all. Don't be a fool, Mega Man. Proto Man, you all right? Lan, Think rationally! This is a heinous, evolving virus! If you don't finish it off, there's no telling how much damage it'll do! But! If you won't do it, I will. Get out of the way! Sorry, Zero. Wait! Len! Mega Man! Dad? I've been listening in. There's no need to delete the Zero virus. You sent me a missed data, remember that? That was Zero's source file, left by Wily. A blueprint, you see. Now that I've fully analyzed it, I can seal in the Zero virus function. So if you do that, Zero will become just another Navi! No deleting! Alright! This is not great, Zero! I don't understand. Why do you want to do this for me? Yeah, I don't get it either. That's the way the lands think. Heh <laughs> you know it. I bet you really do understand, Sho. Not really. I'm just tired of the whole thing. Alright, Zero. I'm gonna transmit you to the Scilab's computer. Okay. Now what? Huh. Mr. Sho, sir. What is it, Proto Man? What? This is... I can sense... Dad? What the? The entire cyber world just shook. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> Look at despair. Where is he? Look out! He's the one who controls this entire account. Who are you? <laughs> I am the one they used to call a professor of the World 3 leadership. I took over after Wily to revive the life virus. The life virus? You're insane! What the? That means... That's right. I called Zero Fourth after Wily froze him and made Starman distribute a fake vaccine to hack all net -nabbies. You are the real criminal! While you were busy fighting the hacked navvies and the Zero Virus, I took the money from the vaccine sales to revive the life virus. What are you trying to do? <laughs> I'm about to start hacking into military computers around the world. The world's final war is about to begin. I'll blast human civilization to bits for Wily's principles. Not if I stop you. Ah, ha 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 ha. What do you think a worm like you can do? Squirm? Oh no. The cyber world's shaking is getting worse. This is too dangerous. Arc. Chrono Man, jack out! Mega Man, jack out! Oh, they put Zero on the top shelf. Dad! We gotta tell everyone about the life virus coming back! There's no need. I just verified it. That guy, who calls himself Professor, just announced his crime to the whole world. He made an announcement? Yes. He announced that he's going to use the life virus to control all military computers around the world. And fire off missiles everywhere! That's horrible! We've got to do something! Leaders from around the world are engaged in frantic negotiations now. But if he's trying to destroy the current world, just like Wily, then I think the negotiations are futile. They can only buy us some time. Dr. Hikari, this problem is more than the center can handle without your help. Shout? Okay, I'll go to the center too. Lan, I have to go. We don't know where the life virus or professor are. Gotta hurry. Huh, yeah! Lan? What's wrong? Well, my room keeps getting cluttered and I don't know why. Mega Man! You know how strong that life virus is! The only reason we beat it last time was because we had Hub.Bat! If we didn't have that, we would have lost! Lan... I don't want to seem pessimistic, but... Do you really think we can win at our current levels? Why is this room so cold? I can see my own air. Hmm? Phone? Hey, Lan! What's wrong with you? Ah, uh, Dex! Don't ask. <laughs> well, anyway, listen up. Gutsman is back to normal at last. So I'm gonna go look for the life virus, too. Have you been listening in on me? You're going too, right? If you are, let's share information. Wait, Dex! Even if we find the life virus, do you really think we can beat it with just Mega Man and Gutsman? I kinda don't think so. Don't be stupid! Lan, what are you afraid of? You're not the only one scared here, you know. We all are! I bet even Shout's scared. But we don't have time to be scared now. Show too. Alright, so hurry up and get ready. I'm going on ahead. Later. Dex was trying to encourage you, Lan. Mega Man! Let's go! Lan! <laughs> How frustrating to have to be encouraged by Dex! Everybody's doing their best right now, and I don't want to lose the show. We can beat that life virus ourselves. You know it. That's the land I know. Alright. First, we gotta find a clue as to where the life virus is. Land, you got email. Yeah, I wonder if that's the clue. Thanks to Dr. Hikari, I'm a real Navi now. 
not just a virus. So thanks, you guys. <laughs> I don't know what to say, really. But the guy who awakened me and used me, the professor, his schemes are not over. Lan Hikari, Mega Man, if you plan to fight this man, I'll lend you my power. This Z-Saber that I wield, now it belongs to you. Oh, I got the Zero Navi chip. Oh, I'll have to replace uh, Fireman with that. I bet that life virus thing is hiding somewhere in the undernet. There's only one place where data of that size can hide without being found. You know the place? The Navi at the entrance to the undernet won't let anyone in. He even told Glide the other day. No way I'd ever let a fancy Navi like you in. So if you see him, be as crude as you can be. Hmm. We're in a bit of a pickle now, aren't we, huh? I can't believe that professor is doing this. I met him a couple times when I was in the World 3, huh? He really looked up to Professor Wily, and was assistant for a long time, huh? After the World 3 was destroyed, he's been seen in the internet a few times. Odds are he has been using the internet as a base of operations, huh? Is he being told to go to the internet? Well, I know where that's to. Like, all we have to do is just... Well, not go here. Ah, actually, there's new things in the shop. What does Higgs be selling now? Cost sword? Okay, that's new. Attack's power is based on custom gauge level. Did I not buy it? Oh, I... I left. Oops. Now, let me actually buy a cuss sword. Because it's new. And I'll get a cold punch. I could really use a cold punch. It's freaking hot in my house. Um. Maybe I should get a full energy. And maybe another. Oh, I can't hold any more of those. What about some mini energy? And maybe I'll save my money. I think I was gonna replace something else. What do I have that I can get rid of? Fireman I don't get a lot of use out of anymore. I'll go to zero. A three-stage attack using the Z-Saber. And it does a hundred damage. You can only carry one of them. Oh, and I can take the Z sa or Z Saber itself. You can only carry one of those as well. Maybe I'll replace the rat on one with it. There you go. Maybe I should get some more elect blades, because I only have six. So basically where we gotta go is the undernet. Alright, let's stop it here. Should we stop it here? And maybe we can just do some looking around. I just noticed it's not even 25 minutes. I'd say we go check it out. I mean, the worst that can happen is if we just get deleted. And even then, that ain't much. Oh wow, we get to try these right away! Okay, that was a bit of a bust because of my position, but that's okay. So you can only use that when you're standing. I wanted to do that in midair, that would've been great. So I think it was right here. This is the internet. Kids aren't allowed in here. Scram! Hey, come on, please! Can't you just let us in? Wait, Mega Man! Didn't you always say this guy hates polite people? We have to be as crude and rude as possible! Really? Are you sure? It's the only way. Give it a shot, Mega Man. There's no time to waste. Okay, Lan. I'll try, um... Hey, you over there! I mean, hey, scumbag! Let us through, jerk! Something like that? Huh? You must be a beginner. You don't have to do better than that. Mega Man, you have to be nastier! You're still too nice. Too nice? Oh, wait. Meaner, eh? 
What? You're gonna try and stop me? Huh? Don't try any funny business or I'll have to stab you. Rar. Wow, you're so nasty. You gotta be from the internet. In you go. Thanks. I mean, thanks, you stinking gutter rat. Hehe. <laughs> Nice work! Your experience finally fighting Needleman really paid off here. That was an arbitrary Navi to be naming. Yeah, they say you can get into the internet from around here. Problem is, there's no way I can get through these narrow parts. Well, that's your problem now. Ooh, this portal's green. This leads to the internet. Go through? Yeah. Let's do this. Wait, we're straight in a boss battle? Proto Man? Hmm. Mega Man? This place. What the? Land? This cyber world is for use by center personnel only. Ordinary people can't get in here easily. Huh? We went through the entrance to the internet. I thought... Huh? Ah, okay. The professor did this. That guy sure gets around. What are you talking about? I think he used an auto-jump trap. Auto-jump? It's a link that sends you to a different place from where you want to go. When a Navi without authorization tries to access the internet, it sends them to the center. I think he's trying to taunt us here at the center. Interesting ploy. On the other hand, if he's trapped the place, then that means... That means the life virus is in the internet, where the link should go. That makes sense. Mega Man, is there nothing you can do? As simple as that trap is, it's very good security. All we can do is look for the auth code. Okay, later showed. Mega Man, I'm gonna check out for now. Oh, I thought we actually had to fight Proto Man right on the spot. I wasn't ready. Yuppers, huh? So sorry I can't help you out, huh? Ah, don't worry about it. Thanks, Higsby. Okay, I'm hanging up. Even Higsby doesn't know anything about the off code. So what we should do now? There are no more clues. Yeah, but we can't give up now. It's pretty clear that this professor is one of the World 3 bosses. And... He may have used X World 3 facilities to create the auth code and the life virus. There's a good possibility that you're right about. Period. That. So, we should check places related to the World 3 very carefully, right? Places related to the World 3. Like where that secret metro line was? Yeah! Or the basement of ACDC school connected with the World 3 headquarters. Okay. That might lead us to surviving the World 3 cyber worlds. It's decided then. Let's check out the X World 3 Cyber World via the school. Hey Lan, you got some email. I figured out a lot of things about the life virus. So listen up. The prototype of the life virus was created in the legendary World 3 area. According to the rumors, the legendary World 3 area is a mysterious area built by the World 3. They say it's past the level 5 security area of Outernet. Even I couldn't find this place. I get the feeling it's there, though. Well, anyway, I've attached a level 5 passcode to this email. If you go to the outer net, try looking for this area. How did you get this? This legendary World 3 area sounds suspicious. Outer net. That's the first place I ran into Starman. Yeah, this area is also related to World 3. Let's check it out later. Dex, you, you didn't even explain to me how you got this level 5 code in the first place. How do you have something of that high of clearance? Also, there's 37 chips I still haven't picked up yet. Wow, that's insane. And my max HP is at 840. Damn. Anyway, let's stop the video here. And in the next part, we actually got two places we can go to. We can actually go over to the school, or we can head on over... Uh, should I head over to the school? Let, let's see what the school is going to be like. I think that's where we're going to go first. 
I just want to scout the place out before I even commit to anything. So this is a secret Metroline Cyber World. I've never been in here before. That's right. The Metro Line used to go directly to the World 3 Headquarters. Since the circuit is still active, that means if we follow it, yeah, we should be able to access areas that the World 3 used to use. Alright, let's go! Uh, let's just do some scouting ahead. I'm probably not gonna finish the area. Oh, some of these you can fall through. That's helpful, I guess. Maybe I can use this spot to get some money. This seems like a prime place to earn some cash. Oh, a bunch of bolts of fall. Oh! Oh! Wow! That was a lot of money you could get. Just here alone! I could probably get some down here, too. Okay, I can live with this. 300 zennies. And over here we get also 300 zennies. More Lombus bread, Mr. Frodo. <laughs> oh, so we can go down here, apparently. I just wanted to see if that was only one way or not. Oh, another HP memory. Alright. Cool. Cool beans. Mm, seems I'm already here. Screw it. Let's finish the whole damn thing. Let's go. It's a little something extra for this. Hmm. Just go. 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 Gone. Oh, we're called 150? I don't know how many of those I can carry one time. And I can afford to be a little greedy. Hope I didn't miss anything over here. Oh, wait a minute. Who nice. I see we have run into some new viruses, eh? These guys are here! Does that mean I'm gonna be facing Shadow Man? I mean, he was in the World 3. Are you kidding me? Oh god, there's a new rat. Oh, this guy. Okay, definitely not a fan of those. Like, even if I try to hit him with a cannon, I'll probably just miss. Because they're so fast. But I can bet I can get really good at Biz Chicks that way. Oh. It's not ready. Can I get over there? No. Maybe I should try this again with double jump. I don't want to miss any uh, data, so you know what? Let's just jack out now so I'm more ready for it. But at least the first area already alone gives you a lot of money. Yeah, I changed my mind. We'll, we'll finish it in the next part. I'm starting to get a bit sweaty again. Alright, so next part we'll go deal with this place. I got 101 chips now, so I got something new at least. It was probably the spice too. Anyway, see you later everyone. Thanks for watching.